space. It is ours for the taking. These are the missions of the Imperial Klingon cruiser Kaput. It's never in the quest to see unclaimed worlds, to seek new species and cultures to serve us, to further expand the Klingon Empire. Mission report, 19th Hickman, 924. Destroyed an Orion Raider in the vicinity of Breath. Such actions will demonstrate to the Barrier Alliance that the Klingon Empire will not tolerate illicit activities within range of our holy world. New mission orders received. Patrol duty near the Alawanir Nebula. Perhaps we shall see some action. I certainly hope so. Kapla! Joey! What is it, Khan? Incoming message for you from Khan Connerk of the battlecruiser Longest. Classification. Clear. Put him on the screen. Hell, Cash. Hell, Connerk. I come with news from the High Council regarding your mission. A simple patrol of a boring nebula. More than that, Cash. Indeed. Do tell. Romulutions. Oh. Interesting. Long range sensor scans from the battle station Gordon indicate a ship near the nebula. Probably using it to hide from our patrols. A proverbial Blas Ricca in the Bastion. Quite. You are to neutralize that threat to the Empire. A worthy challenge. We accept. I knew that this would please you, old friend. Indeed. Thank you, you old Targ. Kapla! Navigator, chart course for the Hollow and Air Nebula. Pilot, graph speed six. Gunner, practice drills. No live rounds. We may need our ammunition. Communications, implement radio silence until further notice. Science, I want details on this pathetic collection of gas and dust. Well, what are you waiting for? Kapla! 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 to subgrass speed. Yes, show sure. Begin scanning for neutron radiation. This nebula has many pockets of neutron radiation. Many sources, my lord. Take us to the nearest one. Then the next. Then the next. Gunner, the hunt is on. Ready your weapons. They warm even now, Captain. Approaching first radiation zone. Cook! Drot, scan it closely. No movement. 
Radiation sources match previous charts. Zor, move us on to the next. Yes, my lord. Sons of our homeworld again, my lord. So, Durant of the House of Durant, you have betrayed us. There is no room in the Empire for weak greybeards like you or the besieged that calls herself our Chancellor. Hold it there, Tar, or die. If you insist. Bring our weapons to bear on that bird of prey. Get us another science officer. Hopefully not another spot. She's on her way. Ha! Ha! Raise them. Yes, my lord. Gunner! Hold weapon. They're receiving our signal, but are not responding. Put me on. This is Captain Kesh of the Imperial Battlecruiser Kabuk. You have fought well. Surrender to us now, and we shall spare your lives and your ship. No reply, Captain. My lord. Their self-destruct device has sustained damage. How unfortunate for them. Success, my lord. So, you are cowards. Too cowardly to answer, too cowardly to show yourselves. Instead, you hide behind that nebula, lurking in the shadows. Too cowardly to die. So, it has come to this. To be taunted by barbarians as we await our destruction at their hands. I have no intentions of destroying your vessel. Instead, we will be turning you and your crew over to the Ministry of Intelligence. Your vessel over to the Ministry of Engineering. I'm sure you can understand the repercussions of these actions. Ah, oh, the pain it'll no doubt lead to. Barbarians. Cowards. So we understand each other. Perfectly. Shall we discuss the terms of your surrender? We would, of course, prefer our deaths instead. No, I could easily arrange that. Under what condition? Perhaps you could explain your presence here? Nonsense. That would give your empire an advantage. So will our mind sifters. Ah, but while our ship's self-destruct device is Still inoperable, Commander. Which, no doubt, your engineers are frantically trying to repair. Is, uh, temporarily unavailable. But we can still commit ritual suicide. Of course you could, but you haven't. Why is that, Commander? Because I have devised a solution for our situation. I presume that would be our mutual destruction. As we lower our shields to activate our transport beams, your soon-to-be-repaired self-destruct device would be engaged, and we're all reduced to atoms in a rather impressive amount of energy. Well, yes, that was the plan. Unfortunately, my engineers have been unable to restore the device to operability. I would propose a fair exchange. You will give me a name or event, 
No. I'll show you mercy. Mercy? From a Klingon? Will you swear upon the sword of Kalos? Of course. I will give you a name. Duran. Uh, an interesting choice. Perhaps more than you realize. You asked for a name or an event, and I have given it to you. Indeed you have. Now I will show you mercy. Noyat, target their brains. You said we could have mercy! And you shall have it. You won't be allowed to explain to your superior how you failed miserably. And you won't be subjected to the cruelty of our mind centers. Extremely merciful, I should say. Closed communications. You may open fire. Reduce that garbage pile to atoms. At once! Investigation of the nebula. Yeah, shoot, shall we? Gunner, maintain vigilance. We may find another bird of prey. Mission report 19th Hecla, 924. Destroyed a Romulan bird of prey in the Alawanir Nebula. Purpose undetermined. Enemy ship destroyed in glorious combat. No survivors. Science officer Garak was discovered to be a traitor and was killed in honorable combat with the ship's pilot. Will remain on patrol duty in the Alawanir Nebula until further notice. Grateful for these actions we saw today. Perhaps we'll see more tomorrow.